This morning I tried to make almond milk in this Ninja blender. I put it in a Ziploc bag and like cut holes in the corners. It kind of worked. It was a lot of effort. you've ever wondered how to make your own nut milk at home when you don't have any of the fancy nut milk bags or anything really to strain it with, cheesecloth or a strainer, this is what you do. You get a plastic bag and you cut a very small hole <laughs> in the one corner of it. And that, my friends, is how you strain almond milk. <laughs> Ideally though, you'd have anything better than this, really. This is like a last resort. The friends that I'm house sitting for down here in Lake Stevens, Washington, they have an Amazon Prime account, so I'm just ordering raw almond butter online. So much easier to add that to a smoothie than to try to filter with a plastic bag or go and buy a filter. Now I'm going to spend a few hours editing my vlogs and I don't think people realize that editing and filming daily vlogs really is like having a full-time job but at the same time I love it so so much and I love being able to use my creativity in the vlogs too so even though it takes a lot of time and a lot of effort I really wouldn't have it any other way. What do you think pretty girl? Oh, everybody's sleepy. It's because the fire's on. Oh, what's wrong? She had a skin problem and had to have her fur shaved off, so that's why her fur is kind of wonky. You okay, Isis? Oh, sleepy puppies. Oh, sweetie pie. <laughs> She's such a vocal little cat. I love her. <laughs> Taking da Pepsi for a walk right now. Tara's gone for almost three weeks, I guess, now. She's down in Seattle. All my leftovers that Tara made, my leftover chili, finished it yesterday, so I'm gonna, I went to the farmer's market this morning and got some stuff, just some basic staple foods, and making a lot of work for Tara, editing my nonsense out of these videos. Now, I gotta keep an eye on my dog because we're down by the river and he likes to roll in dead fish. Pepsi, come here, come here. Good boy. Well, I suppose I should go and warm up the cabin since Tara is gone. Kick my feet up, leave the toilet seat up, crack a beer, you know, do some man stuff. While Ryan is out doing all of his man stuff, I'm down here in the United States looking after the animals and spending my Friday evening doing yoga and meditating. The reason I'm stretching while I meditate is because it really helps me focus my mind and get into that kind of flow of meditation. I don't really like to sit in one position for a long time, so adding in light yoga stretches really helps me with that. And it is such a far cry from how I used to spend my Friday evenings years ago, just wanting to get rip-roaring drunk and having a good time that way. And my priorities have completely changed now. I would way rather spend a Friday evening in doing meditation and yoga because I enjoy living a simple life and I really, really love living my life this way now.